Hello and welcome to MindMeister. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use connections to draw relationships between topics on your mind map. I've already logged into MindMeister and opened one of my maps, so we can jump right in. Connections are a great way to show relationships or links between different topics on your map. Let's start by selecting a topic. Right-click or select the ellipsis to bring up the styling panel. Under the Action icon, select Connections. If you'd like to use Quick Keys, you can pull up the Connections option on a selected topic by holding Alt plus C. You'll now see four green plus signs surrounding the topic. These are all points where you can create a connection on your topic. Select one of the plus signs. And there's no need to click and hold. Once you've selected a connection point, you are free to drag it anywhere on the map. To attach it to another topic, simply hover over the desired topic. You'll see four green points highlighted on the destination topic. Click one of the four points to drop the connection. Now you have two topics connected. You can move the angle of the connection line by clicking and holding the point in the middle of the line. To change the line's color and style, click on the line to bring up the options. You can also change the endpoint styles. Click on the center arrow to swap the two connection points. If you want to add a label, click the ellipsis and select Add Label. You can type in a word or phrase, and you can even use emojis. To edit the label, navigate back to the menu to click the ellipsis and select Edit or Delete Label. Want to move a connection? It's easy to change where the connection line attaches to a topic, or even move the line to an entirely different topic. To do this, select the connection line. Once selected, hover over the point you want to move. Click and hold. You can now drag it to a new location. To remove the connection, select the line to bring up the menu. Then click the ellipsis. Here, select Delete Connection. That's it. Now you're able to create useful connections in all of your mind maps. If you have any questions or get stuck, be sure to check out other tutorials on YouTube or visit our help center. Thanks for watching and happy mapping.